Good morning. This is Jennifer, Dr. J. Tebow, and I wanted to jump in and give you a quick podcast about this morning. Not necessarily my morning, maybe not your morning, but about this particular morning. Um, I'll, but I'll share mine. I was fortunate enough to wake up and I've got this huge window in my bedroom and it overlooks downtown Montreal. And I get a chance to see the sunrise from the darkness. It is the most amazing view, and I swear every single morning it is a different view. I don't know how that's possible, but it happens. Sometimes the sunrise is pink, sometimes it is more of an orange amber, but it's beautiful all the same. And I can't help but be reflective and grateful for Number one, that I'm actually seeing the day. Uh, Number two, at just the awesomeness of nature and what I consider God's creation. It makes it really, really difficult after seeing that to hit snooze. It makes it difficult to complain. It makes it difficult to want to do anything less than your best, anything less than amazing, because you've witnessed something that's already amazing. It's like starting off your day amazing. So the rest of it, the parts that you can control, you work your hardest not to disappoint what you saw this morning. Um, I find that when people are going into their corporate jobs, uh, it's not always just a corporate gig, but uh, you know, it's, it's the bulk of my experience in dealing with working adults. I find that people start to become beaten down by the things that may be happening at the job, uh, conflict, uh, communication issues, and maybe a misapplication of their own talents. So they start to feel hopeless in how they're going to be applied or their future with the company. And so all that translates to in the morning, no matter how beautiful the view may be, you hit snooze and then you hit it again and again because you're really... Your body, your mind, your everything is saying, I'm not ready or I don't want that. And I think that is really a shame. Uh, It's really delaying the amazing that you could be um, happening upon, that you could start that journey. But we don't want to hit snooze. What I know is that your, your viewpoint is your compass, right? That is the... That's the direction that you go. So if your view is bleak, if you open your eyes and you immediately have this, oh, no, not now, I'm not ready, not yet, what do you think the rest of your day is going to be? It's going to be mediocre at best. Now, let me flip the script for a moment and talk about corporate recruitment, finding talent, and how we go about that. Can you imagine if a recruiter is steadily hitting snooze that day? Okay, just think about that for a moment. Let that sink in. If you have a recruiter that's designed, their role is to find talent, find the next best talent that's going to move your company forward. That's the goal, right? Not fill gaps, not keep you in the same place. To move you forward. And that recruiter is hitting snooze, you're in trouble. (laughs) You're in big time trouble. If the one finding the talent is also dreading going into the job. Uh, so I will say corporations very rarely check in with one of their most valuable resources, which is their finders of talent, um, those who specialize in that area. But the second thing is for those recruiters, if you are filling a job requisition, right? That's that old school term, job rec. If you're filling some bullets on a page, if you are trying to replace someone, if that's your mindset, you're failing miserably because all you're really doing is like filling potholes on the street. You're not making a new street. You're not going to end up at a new destination. We've got to start thinking bigger and greater and growth when we endeavor to open our eyes, look out, see the sun up and us come up as well. So that's about this morning. I want us to be very mindful of what it means to be a part of the growth of the day, the rising of the day, and that once we finally close our eyes, probably after the sun goes down, have we improved 
what happened today. Have we made a difference, not just in our own lives, but in all of the people that we touch? That's the goal, in my opinion. It's not just to fill the gaps. It's not just to patch up the road. It's to make it better. All right, that's it. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Make sure that viewpoint, that compass is headed in the right direction. You can always keep up with me at Jen Tebow in social media, as well as JenniferTebow.com and the Take care.